then there's a whole array of lithium ions and um whole array of lithium ions and um well, it's flooded all that but. all right so richie went to the car to find a spanner to help us with the uh, drill and chuck removal problem uh, and came back with a battery for a e bicycle um which uh, we were hoping might happen to be uh, lithium uh, iron, but um, uh, sorry, lithium. Uh, so 18650s, but unfortunately, it looks like it might be uh, lithium, big fat hairy lithium polymer cells. So um, let's gonna see if we can pull that apart, see what's inside of it. Uh, we're meant to be fixing it for a friend of ours. Uh, and again, it could just get shoved inside the robot lawnmower instead. And um, yeah. Anyway, yeah, we'll show you it once we've got this Christmas present unwrapped. So what do you reckon we've got then, Richie? Two, four, six, eight, ten. Probably so twenty of them. Close to 20, 20, 20, 20 cells. Twenty to twenty-two. Yeah. And it looks like there's a something a control, in the top there. Control board maybe in the top. Mm. Let's see if we can get in there. Anyway, yeah. Um, robot lawnmower project has uh, been put on hold, and uh, well, we're just getting into some other stuff for a bit. So uh, we've got stuff to come. Chuck yeah, I can't get the chuck off. We might angle grind it off in a minute. Let's see how we do. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24. So 24 cells and what looks like um, an array of uh, high power drivers. Uh, with my finger, there it is, down in there. And there's also a PCB in here with a few bits of. Um, surface mount on it so a few chips and bits and bobs so uh, battery management system um anyway yeah uh hmm, interesting stuff yeah so um looking at the side of the uh thing uh lithium ferrite polymer uh lithium ion isn't it fe ion yeah sorry yeah lithium ion polymer no l-i-i-o lithium ion so yeah lithium ferrite they are mm -hmm. lithium yeah ion. Uh, oh, it probably is, yeah. Um, yeah, and in there, that's quite interesting. I don't know if you can see down inside there, but there's many, many little tiny chips. Um, many little battery management chips, by the looks of things. Or possibly regulators or something weird, but yeah, it's going to be battery. It's going to be, yeah, battery, battery management stuff, isn't it? Anyway, um, yeah, Tony. Um, your uh, your battery pack is uh, is a bit broken, mate. Yeah. All right. So here we are. Then we've got um, twelve fat, hairy lithium cells, and uh, all of their associated connections and a common ground go into this board. And uh, so I guess the idea really is to poke a, a voltmeter in here and see if we can find out which one of these cells or which cells are good and which cells are bad. And at least we know then how many we need to replace for Uncle Tony so he can use his electrical bicycle. Ooh. Yeah. So what are you doing, Richie? I'm just gonna go through each cell and see if it yeah. see which ones are dodgy. Poking so, some cables down the side. Yeah, the, uh, so that should be the first cell. Yeah, 3.3. 3.3. There's the second cell. 6.6, .6, so that's in series, I guess. Yeah, I, I'm just going from the ground. Shall I, shall I just wander up with 6 it? 6.6 again. I haven't gone up, or shall I just keep going up like this? Keep going up like that, see? 9.9. .9. It's going up in uh, mm. It's all going up in order, isn't it? 13.3. Mm. Yeah, 13.3. 16.6. 19.9. .9. So yeah, I guess you probably have to follow them up. Yeah. Otherwise, we're going to have to do math, aren't we, to subtract the, yeah, the uh, numbers from the numbers. Right, let's go back to uh, so let's go back to somewhere down here. Right, Tony, we're working on your battery. Yay! What have we got on the table today? Uh, we have an array of adjustable Spaniards wrenches. If you're American, uh, Richie brought over some bangers. It's going to be fun. We'll have a have a play with these a bit later on. Cables, sharpies, screwdrivers, oily rags, 
pair of sunglasses, very important when the sun's gone in. Um, a Fluke 77 multimeter, a Leatherman Surge, a cheap, cheap Chinesium Hamadou, uh, which cost me 89 NT. It's about 40 NT to a pound. So it's about two, two pound and ten pence or something like that. Um, <laughs> And then there's a whole array of lithium ions and um, lithium polymers, sorry. And yeah, anyway, we've measured the voltages and whatnot and um, where the black mark is, uh, reckon that's uh, zero volts, that bad boy. Everything else is about 3.3, 3.4 volts. And of course, we have the robot lawnmower and a magnificent plant in the corner.